What makes me unique is I have no legs and I'm a, I was born this way. And God made me this way. I'm just always happy. I just, every morning I just wake up with a smile on my face saying, today's gonna be a great day. It's what I do. Bring it in, boys, bring it in. Isaiah Byrne does not see a disability in himself. He doesn't believe that he's different than any other kid. He does anything that any other kid does, sometimes better. Nine-year-old Isaiah was introduced to sports coach Miguel Rodriguez by his school principal in 2012. The first time that I met Isaiah, uh, I remember that like uh, if it was yesterday. My boss came to my classroom. He asked me if I, uh, if I wanted to meet a uh, very special young man. I said, hey, dude. He said, like, what's your name? My name's, I said, my name's Isaiah. I want to play basketball. You want to play basketball with me? And I saw this young man hopping around playing basketball. It was shocking. He had no legs. And I was amazed at how quick and how happy he was. Isaiah has experienced uh, ups and downs as far as the reaction that he gets from other kids or other people when they see him. They, he knows that people are looking at him. He knows that he's different. Some people might react like, oh, oh, he's so cute, oh my God, he's amazing. And he might get the reaction from my kid saying, what the, what is going on in here? Mean people will say like, you had no legs, you can't go up there, you can't come down here. And I would be like, mean to me, I don't go with that, just not nice, it's rude. He is used to every reaction up there, and that's a blessing. I think that's, that's, that's amazing that at such a young age, he's able to know how to handle situations like that. Coach took Isaiah under his wing. He is fearless. One day we went into a uh, summer camp and there was a trapeze station and, and he said to me, coach, I, uh, I want to try that. And I'm looking at all the way up there and I'm like, that's pretty high. I don't know, you sure you want to try it? And he said, coach, I, I want to try it. And next thing you know, he was just uh, flying in the air with, with no legs, like, with nothing. So that was, that was pretty cool. Coach has helped increase Isaiah's confidence in sport. He does it all. He serves, and he does it very well. He plays soccer. He happens to be great in soccer, too. What we do with our feet, he does with his hands. He likes to play baseball. Sometimes we go into a batting cage. He loves skating. Uh, he loves to get on the skateboard, and, and, and that's a way for him to move really fast and keep up with us when we're running. When I go training, everyone, we always stay together, and we run together on the boardwalk. I really enjoy the skateboard. It's like running at the same time, because I'm using my hands. Today, Isaiah's heading to a wrestling tournament. You guys have fun last night? I'm ready. Yeah, what time you go to bed? 10. 10? We're going to stop by Brands really quick and get breakfast, because I know you'll you get cranky if you don't eat. Well, Isaiah has come along a really long way. He's been wrestling for now. This will be his fifth year in the wrestling team. But it's, it's way more than that. It's the way he started. Oh, he's always smiling. That's it. It's awesome. It's not an option. Good luck. Thank you. Thank you. In the beginning, of course, like everyone else, he wasn't the superstar. He was not uh, uh, the toughest guy. He was, you know, he was just a beginner like everyone else. And listen, you have to conserve your energy. You know how long these tournaments are, OK? As soon as you win, you can get something to eat. You guys got your food ready. Coach, when he's at a competition, he tells me what to do. Go for the single. He comes to a double. Go for the takedown. Hey, pull him down. This way, hard. Hey. He's right there. Why are you reaching out? Go, go, go. Let's go, let's go, 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 go. go, go. <laughs> he says, you do. You did a great job, and you also tried your best. Sometimes when I lose, he says you also try your best too. Isaiah's got big dreams for the future. I would like to be an actor one day. I like to be a firefighter, a police person, anything. Uh, we would like for Isaiah to be, of course, the best that he can be. We want him to achieve anything that he wants to be in life. He dreams big. Uh, sometimes he'll tell me, coach, I want to be a police officer. Coach, I want to be a uh, 
a wrestling coach. Coach, I want to be a lawyer. Coach, I think I want to be a doctor. Coach, I think I want to be a surfer instructor. We, we tell him that he can be any of that. He can be anything that he wants to be. We believe that if we continue to do what we're doing as a team, because it's not just me, it's the community, it's the team, it's the family, he will be an amazing human being when he gets old. I think I'm a different because I'm the same like others. It's just that we're just, we're just we have a heart and we're the same.